Sombo, uh, being the first enclave that was created after the construction of the dam, will be to recreate, as it were, um, a more resilient township where technology is going to be at the end thing for our infrastructure to ensure that we have a hub, a technology hub in Akosombo to make the residents um, understand and you know, live in the new age. It's also going to help us in our operations and the smart city is going to ensure that our infrastructure, we are going to optimize the use of our infrastructure. And so we're going to build data centers, we're going to have data centers and you know everywhere within the township there will be the opportunity to be linked to technology so that you know the residents, the businesses around will create that kind of industrial park that is support national development. So basically the Akosombo Smart City is rebuilding you know the Akosombo Township to be more resilient, to be more technologically oriented and to deliver more for national development. And that is all right. So the electronic bus will be part of the introduction of the smart city. So um, we are actually at a stage where we are procuring uh, consultancy services uh, to to get this whole project, you know, in place. So within the course of the year, we're going to start that initiative. And one key aspect of that whole smart city project is the introduction of the electric buses. Mm. So. But deadline to this, when are you expecting this to be achieved? I think at this point, mm. it should be more prudent to say that the project is about to start and um, we would want to keep deadlines. Um, so you can see it start, you see the introduction of the electric buses this year, and then that will be the initial you know, uh, uh, activity to the smart city. But we've already actually spoken with, you know, with a lot of people who have expressed interest uh, in setting up establishing data centers and you know, in our own operations, we've introduced digitalization in our operations. One key element that we're also introducing this year is the digital transformation and innovation project, which will encompass all the other elements of technology that we want to introduce into our operations, including the Akusobo Smart City project. I know it may be early days yet, but you talked about um, Akusobo being the first place. Are there any plans or broader consultations to spread this? Yes, yes definitely. But uh, you know, I mentioned Akusobo as the first thing. Yes. We have Akuse also, which is one of our enclaves because we have the old dam power plant also in Akuse. In, in Akuse. Uh, we have the Akusobo dam here, the powerhouse is here. We have a Boise thermal plant in the western region. We have the Tema, we have the I mean, we have powerhouses in all this, and we have enclaves. So the enclave means that we have the powerhouse, we have uh, our families and our staff staying here. With our, we have all other value added support services that actually make the township a holistic township where you know our staff live and uh, and work. And with their families, we have the schools, we have the hospitals, we have the hotel, we have the water river, the water lake transport, and all such facilities that really make it a full enclave. So the enclave in our operations means that you have to do everything, all, all inclusive township for VRA operations. Okay, all right, thanks.